sack full of smiles. One day, Miss Arpita gave her pupils a new assignment, an assignment on happiness. Her pupils would be happiness characters and were to see what would happen when they tried to bring happiness to those around them. As part of their assignment, all the students did greatly amusing, wonderful things. But what Muskan did left, everyone got smacked. Several days after the assignment had been handed out, Muskan turned up carrying a big sack. Here in this bag, I have all the happiness I have collected so far, she said, smiling. On seeing this, everyone was filled with expectation. But Muskan didn't want to show anyone what was in the sack. Instead, she pulled out a small box and gave it to her teacher. When Miss Arpita had taken the box, Muskan took an instant camera out of her pocket and stood with it at the ready. She quickly said, Open it, Miss. The teacher slowly opened the box and looked inside. A big smile shone on her face and at that moment Muskan snapped a photo. Muskan's photo popped out the camera and she offered it to Miss Arpita along with a sheet of paper. The teacher read the paper in silence and when she had finished, she gestured over at the sack. Oh, so it is. Yes, interrupted Muskan, undoing the knot which sealed the sack. It's a great big pile of smiles. She opened the sack and hundreds of photos fell out. All of different smiles, each one of them beautiful. The rest of the class tried to work out how Muskan had managed to create such a great big chain of happiness. All there was in the box was a photo of a big smile. But everyone who had seen it had felt happiness being transmitted to them. And in return, without even thinking about it, every person had responded with a smile of their own. With all her classmates now smiling, Muskan took a photo of each one of them. She gave them their own photo along with a slip of paper, which asked them to do the same with other people. And to send a copy of the photos to her home address. And for months afterwards, Muskan's post box was always full to the rim with photos of happy, smiling people. And so, it was that she managed to spread understanding of the simple truth that every time you smile, you are sending a gift to the world. To smile is to be cheerful in a wonderful, contagious and effortless way. It is really a difficult task to not like a person who is smiling at you. Remember that when you spread smiles and happiness, you are doing a fantastic and a noble job. Smiling is good for health too. It takes a greater number of facial muscles to frown than it does to smile. A smile costs nothing but gives much. It enriches those who receive without making poorer those who give. It takes a moment, but the memory of it sometimes lasts forever. A smile is a language even a baby can understand. Whenever you are sad, remember that happiness is just grim away. Life may not be the party you hoped for, but while you are here, you might as well as dance. So, be happy, spread happiness and live your life to the fullest. Vocabulary Word Power a good vocabulary is essential to express ourselves in a clear and precise manner. Follow these simple steps to increase your word power. Find some words from the lesson, the meaning of which is not clear to you. Write them in your notebook. Take a dictionary and write their meaning. You can request your teacher or parents to help you. Now, type whether the given statements are true, T, or false F. Match the following. Chapter 2 